Hello everyone, welcome once again in Cool IT Help. Guys, this is the another video tutorial on the Java FX. So here I will tell you how you can set a minimize button in the undecorated stage. Yes, if you are setting your stage undecorated, so you have to put a customize minimize button to minimize the stage. So I will discuss and I will share you the same thing in this tutorial. So I have prepared the example project here, a sample project in my NetBeans IDE. Also I have given the link of the same project in the description box so you guys can download and do more experiment with this. But here I will show you what are the main points that you should know to make more changes. Okay, to use the same thing in another project. So here is the stage, the application is running and I am using the FXML based project here. So we have this stage and this is movable. Also we have this minimize button in the right corner and once you click on it, the stage will minimize. It's easy, it's very simple. Again you will click back on the this icon so stage will be restored. So guys you have seen this thing and now come here in the code so this is our project and we have these files this is the fxml file the GUI that I am using here so you can use uh, any GUI that you want so you can create your fxml file and use with this project and the main thing I would like to show you so first we will see here in the minimize button example.java file so what we are doing here here we have simple thing we have the parent so the parent object is getting from the get resource fxml loader dot load method and we have to pass the fxml that we are using here this is the fxml and once we get the root object so we are setting it uh, into the scene and then uh, we setting the root style that means the stage style that is transparent also we setting we have initialized the stage style undecorated so we are not seeing any uh, minimize maximize or close button on the right corner of the stage okay guys now close this file and come here in the controller file so here what we are doing we have set a small button on the fxml okay and now we are handling the event and we doing a click on that button and this will close the stage so first i will show you the fxml so here is the fxml let me copy the path of this fxml so this is the path and here is the scene builder I will show you what are the points you need to know so guys this is the fxml you can see here in the right corner I am using a simple button okay so this is the button and I have set a fx id minimize button okay so we will handle the click action of this button so on action I have set this method handle button action okay guys and now close this and now come back in the controller because once you press once you click on that button the action is generated and that event is handled by this method okay handle button action method so the concept is simple you have to just click on that button and the stage will be closed so we need a stage object so we are getting the stage object in this way okay so this is the anchor pane object that is coming from the fxml so in the fxml you can see we have assigned a fx id this is the anchor pane and the same fx id we are using here as a reference object okay and in this method we are getting the stage object with the help of this get scene dot get windows method okay once you get this thing uh, 
you have to use simple method stage dot set iconified true okay so you have to write this line on the button click okay that will minimize your stage and rest of the things is handled by the system automatically okay guys so the only thing we have to write here the stage dot set iconified and we need the stage object in this way we have another way we can get the stage object from this line as well so you can use both you can use one of them okay so I am closing this and in the initialize method what we have in the initialize method I am setting uh, a small image this is the minimize image I am using this image to display uh, this image on the button okay so I am setting that image here on this button the cross image this minimize image okay now come back to the controller this is the simple thing create the image object with the help of this new image and you have to pass the new file input stream and here we have to use the path of the image then the file input stream object is created here and passing in the constructor of the image class so we will get this image object okay once we get this thing we we are setting on this button okay so here's the button this is the button and we have this the reference of this object here okay with the help of add the rate fxml and now you have to call set graphics method okay so, so set graphics method will set the that image on the button it's simple but we have to use a node that means we have to use image view object to set the image okay on the button so this line is setting the image on the button okay guys this is simple now save the project and do a clean build okay now I'm going to run okay guys see this the stage appeared and uh, here's the button minimize button so you need to click on this button and the stage will be minimized now see this okay it's working perfectly okay guys I hope you got the clear understanding on this concept if if you still have any doubt so please comment below I will try to reply as soon as possible and guys if you found this video useful so please like share and subscribe my channel and keep watching cool IT help for upcoming videos on JavaFX thanks for watching